What up gamers? Yesterday we had likely our last Red Dead Redemption 2 trailer unveil before launch next week. Before I showcase it, remember that this is the last week to enter into the channel giveaway where I'll be giving away a free copy of Red Dead Redemption 2. Tap fire the card at the end of this video or click the link down in the description box below to get details on the giveaway. Now let's check out the quick launch trailer before I get into some other details we learned this week. If you've already seen it, skip ahead about a minute. Let's dive in. One more big score, we got enough money to leave. What do you think? Yeah. Nothing means more to me than this game. I would kill for it, I would happily die for it. I wish things were different. But it weren't us who changed. Trust me, Arthur. Just one more That's trip. always a goddamn train. <laughs> I don't want to kill all these folk, Dutch. Just you. What about loyalty? Loyal to what matters. Do as you're goddamn told. It is us or him! Red Dead Redemption 2, coming October 26th, rated M for Mature. And there you go, once again Rockstar gets us hyped with some new story footage from Red Dead Redemption 2. Likely what we're seeing here is the train robbery that we learned of long ago on the Red Dead website where apparently the robbery the game partakes in is gone very wrong outside of Blackwater, and then Arthur and the Vanderlyn gang are forced to flee. You see in the trailer some dialogue between the gang and the law and view our potential nemesis within the story itself. And then of course, after fleeing, and with federal agents and bounty hunters on our tails, you and the gang will have to rob, steal, and fight their way across the rugged frontier of America set in 1899. Of course, it wouldn't be a true Red Dead sequel without the drama and tough decisions we have to forego within the story. And thanks to an article from The Vulture this week, we've also learned that Red Dead Redemption 2 will showcase about 60 hours of gameplay, 300,000 animations, and 500 thousand lines of dialogue. And with that, apparently five hours have been taken out of the story due to a love interest of authors that just didn't quite fit in. But even with these five hours now out of the story, 60 hours is still an immense amount of story and dialogue to take in. I'm sure many of you out there, including myself, will get stuck in exploring the world that Red Dead has to offer for hours on end. I mean, just think of it. Hunting, fishing, playing poker, helping out the gang's camp, getting enough materials gathered to craft new outfits and other customization options, roaming the world while dealing with law, bounty hunters, and rival gangs, antagonizing or helping the citizens across the world. Hell, I'm not going to lie, I'm tempted to follow a random NPC to see exactly what they do through a full day and night cycle. I mean, I'm not bored, I just want to see what the hell they're doing. And this all doesn't even include the online mode that we're set to test out in beta come November. Also, if you didn't catch it, either on their Twitter or if you're not in the newsletter for the website, Rockstar also popped up a new section on their website that showcased some of the weapons we'll be handling and customizing within the Red Dead sequel, such as the Cattleman Revolver, the Volcanic Pistol which comes back from the previous title, the famous Springfield Rifle, the Lichfeld Repeater, and that sawed off shotgun we've seen a lot of in the previous trailers. And of course, each of these weapons will have their own pros and cons depending upon the situation you get yourself into while either out on the town or in the frontier. As I stated in the previous trailer breakdown, you will also have different ammo types available to you like split point, high velocity, and even explosive ammo. So with that said, we are now less than a week to go till launch of the title. Not sure of everything I'll be covering here on the channel, I have a couple ideas already, but I want to hear from you out in the community. What would you like to know about Red Dead Redemption 2 after launch? Would you be interested in best weapons breakdowns, what horse is best in battle, author's progression system? Let me know your ideas down in the comments below. And come launch on October 26th, as usual, I will post the first hour of gameplay on the channel if you're still lingering on the idea of purchasing the game. The rest will be streamed from my Twitch channel, and if you pre-order the game yourself, you can go ahead and start downloading that massive game file on your console right now. So get ready gamers, because soon we'll be on horseback exploring the frontier, robbing trains, and showcasing our skills in duels in Red Dead Redemption 2. Yes I know, it's a short one today, but all the new information will come when I deep dive into the game come launch.
If you enjoyed this video, then give it a like and tap fire subscribe for future gaming content and updates. Don't forget to share with your friends and come chat with me on Twitch when I'm live. See you out on the winding trail gamers. This is Sir Mav, signing off.